Yo. <gasps> what is that? A fucking paper towel. No. In the engine. Are you kidding? It's a fucking napkin. What are, what are you doing today? Yanking this motor up so we can uh, strip her down and get it rebuilt. Do we know what year this G is? Uh, it's so, 03. G35. Uh, he wants a built mortar so we can, you know, boost it later on down the road. So he's getting, you know, the full BQ package. Yeah. Engine's out. <laughs> yep. Good job. We out. Did you get uh, stuck up? Caught up on anything or pretty simple? Uh, it's always a pretty straightforward pull. Steering, yeah. steering column shaft is always the one to you know, be stuck on, be a pain in the ass. But outside of that, it's usually a pretty straightforward pull. <laughs> this thing has so much random like leaves and stuff. I feel oh, like yeah. there was like a little mousy in here, just stash in the. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, that was the first thing you did. I forgot about that. Yeah, we tried to harness and make sure the car ran. All right, so now to tear it apart. I'll we'll get the transmission off, the engine off, and then subframe back in so the car can steer around and push it to the other shop. All So we have uh, Steven's engine pulled. Um, we'll begin to uh, disassemble it and have a look at the internals and everything and uh, get it down sent to the machine shop shortly. Um, in the meantime, we'll get some things cleaned up and the car put back together so it's at least mobile. And then uh, we'll go ahead and tear this down. Uh, so we got to put the front subframe back in, get all the suspension back together so we can get the front wheels on and then get it off the left. Okay. Fun stuff. This is clutch? Old clutch? What kind of uh, clutch do we get? Clutch Masters? Yeah. As per usual? Yep. We love Clutch Masters.
about to do. Crack this fish open. <laughs> wait, wait, should we get, should we show everybody, um... Snickers, I was getting the Snickers, I was getting the... Whoa! The awesome coop job. <laughs> Yo! <gasps> what is that? A fucking paper towel? No. In the engine? Fucking napkin. Why is it that every time we open up an engine, it's like some dumb shit? The craziest surprises. What does that remind you of that string? What do you mean? Confetti? It reminds me of something, like that stuff you spray out of a can. Oh the that? uh what the hell is that spray? I don't know what you're talking about. Like it's like it's like wet on the tip of my tongue, too. No, um, it's like uh, Silly String? Yeah, that, Silly that, String. That's what it reminds me of.
All right. So we have uh, Steven's engine pulled and disassembled out of his G35. Um, he came in wanting an engine build and uh, upgrade to a CDO9 transmission. Uh, plans for boost later on down the road. And um, the vehicle just had a lot of miles on it. So he just wanted everything gone through and made sure everything was perfect. Um, so no real concern or reason to take apart the engine or remove it. Um, Luckily, we did because upon disassembly, we found metal shavings in the bottom of the oil pan. Um, we moved the valve cover, and there was a paper towel stuck behind one of the camshafts. Fucking paper towel. And um, the oil pickup was kind of clogged up with some of that paper towel material. So it looks like um, cylinder number one rod bearing was actually getting ready to spin. Um, we can see here the heavy bearing damage and they're, they're completely cupped and don't even fit inside of the rod properly anymore. Um, so luckily no uh, damage to the crankshaft that can't be polished out and reused but um, you know it kind of goes to show you just because it uh, sounds good, runs good and uh, looks good doesn't mean that all is good. Um, so definitely made the right decision to tear apart the engine and do a build before just boosting the stock internals. So yeah, we'll get it set on down to the machine shop and uh, get the block all prepped and machined and uh, get her going. Send it. Let him know that he made a good decision. What a, yeah. must have been his intuition. <laughs> <laughs>